Hi guys, this is the Unity for Beginners series uh, that will accompany your lectures and tutorials at the university. And this series, which is a um, standalone series of um, sort of concise tutorials that focus on the most sort of basics of Unity. And they should help you progress through your practical tutorials. Whereas the theory uh, of game development, of uh, how Unity works and so on, we're going to cover in the lectures. First of all, um, you will need to download Unity Hub. All of the links will be available from the video description. And once you have registered and have a license, which is for free personal use, um, for university computers, you don't need licenses because they're already installed. So once you have that, uh, open Unity Hub. Uh, you might need to sign in and then go to installs and then click add. Once you've done that, you're able to select uh, one of the Unity versions to download and install. The one that we use this year, and this is the version that's installed uh, on university PCs, is 2019.4. So click on that and then next and then install. Once uh, it is installed. We're going to go to projects and click new. We're going to select a 2D project. We're going to give our project a name, something like test 2D uh, underscore one. Choose the location where to install this template and then click create. It will go away and um, start initializing your uh, template that you can then use to test out the environment. So for this um, session, we just want to make sure that Unity itself works. Uh, and then in the next video, we're going to also pair Unity with Visual Studio, because that's the ID that we'll be using to edit some of the scripts, uh, as they're called, uh, some of the behaviors of game objects. <clears throat> so I think it's done it. You should be able to see a very similar looking window. And then you can just click play. And you should see something like this. And that is essentially what we need um, in this video. So we want to have our sample scene, main camera, and that is pretty much it. We're not going to touch anything else just yet. We'll click play again to exit. Um, your game sort of state and this is as far as we're going to go. So in the next video we're going to install Visual Studio and link it with Unity. Thanks for watching, until then.